Hi, this is Mike Palmer with Group One Trading, and this is the Investitute Volatility Sonar Report. We're coming here on Tuesday morning. We are after a three-day weekend, so I want to talk about what we see in the VIX index after a three-day weekend. So the VIX is calculated off of the options in the S&P 500, right over to my left here, and it's basically a calculation off of all the puts and all the calls and it's a blend of what is 30 days out. Now, when we head into a three-day weekend, a lot of the traders in the SP 500, they do something what they call days ahead. That means they move the calendar on their valuation for those options up a day. That because they say it's a three-day weekend, it's going to, these options are going to decay a lot over a three-day weekend. And what you would see is the VIX calculation itself, because it's still pricing as if it's Friday, but their model, they're moving it to Saturday, so that makes the VIX actually depress a lot on Fridays, and especially on, on three-day weekends on Fridays. Today, we come in Tuesday, all their models go back to today being Tuesday, all very accurate right there, and what you would actually see is the VIX index, the calculation itself, pop on that Tuesday after a three-day weekend. That's why the VIX right now is up about 90 cents, and the SP 500 is exactly unched. Um, and so that's an interesting thing to look at. That's why you really want to think about the futures in the VIX. The options are priced off the futures. The futures are very reliable. And you'll see none of this impact of moving out of a weekend and that kind of stuff uh, when you look at the futures themselves. So the VIX index is trading 14. It was probably a little bit artificially pushed down on Friday because of the three-day weekend. Um, but it's trading about 14 right now, which seems uh, pretty accurate considering the movement we're seeing in the market. Uh, what I, another thing I want to note here is the VIX weekly option classes are definitely getting more active. We saw a big seller today of the June 22nd expiration, 22 calls. They sold those at 22 cents, so it's all twos right there. Uh, and they sold roughly 4,000 of those. We're seeing the size and the frequency of these VIX weekly options trades picking up pretty steadily uh, for, since for the last couple weeks here. So it's definitely becoming a, a new feature of the VIX uh, options class. Uh, that's all that's going on here. So far, a pretty quiet day in the beginning of a four-day week. Uh, this is Mike Palmer with Group 1 Trading, and this is the Investitude Volatility Sonar Report.